The Queen's decision to express her wish that Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, be known as Queen Consort has been dissected by royal experts who suggested a clever reason for the timing of the announcement. Queen Elizabeth II, 95, marked the 17th anniversary of her accession to the throne last weekend. To celebrate her platinum jubilee, the monarch said it was her wish that Camilla be known as Queen Consort when Prince Charles becomes King. When Camilla and Charles tied the knot 17 years ago, Clarence House said the Duchess of Cornwall would be known as Princess Consort when Charles succeeds his mother as sovereign. The move was seen as a sensitive gesture by the royals, following the death of Charles' first wife, Diana, Princess of Wales. Her Majesty's announcement about Camilla's future title has been analyzed by royal experts who suggested there was a clever reason behind the monarch's timing. The Daily Mirror's online features editor Zoe Forsey claimed the Queen's health may have factored in her decision to use her accession anniversary to announce her wishes for Camilla. The journalist chatted to the newspaper's royal editor Russell Myers yesterday on their royal podcast Pod Save the Queen. Ms. Forsey said, there was a lot of surprise around the fact that she'd used this message in her 70th year to make this announcement. But the more I thought about it, it then made sense of why she did use it then. Because if she just put this statement out randomly in two years' time, I think everyone will go, oh what's wrong, why is she doing this? Is she about to step down? Is there a health thing we all should worry about? In October, there were concerns for the Queen as she was admitted to King Edward VII's hospital in London for preliminary medical checks. The monarch's overnight stay at the hospital came after she cancelled a string of public engagements. However, Her Majesty returned to Windsor Castle the following day and was later told to rest by doctors for two weeks. The monarch's temporary absence from her face-to-face -face duties meant she had to miss the Glasgow COP26 Climate Change Summit, among other events. Ms. Forsey claimed the Queen may have been aware of how her Camilla announcement would be received if it was not time for a major anniversary. She said, I think it probably would have sent people into panic mode. So, do you think it was perhaps to avoid that? Mr. Myers agreed, suggesting that the Queen may have planned how she was going to make her announcement some time ago. He said, that is a great shout to be honest, because she has had her own health problems. There is no better time I suppose than announcing it now. Her age is an undeniable fact. And so are her health issues. So, perhaps it was planned like this all along. If it had been a standalone statement, then perhaps there would have been a bigger deal made of it. To subscribe to Pot Save the Queen, go to your normal podcast provider.